10 out of our base. I'm like one foot on the edge of this ramp, putting the board down. You do have to come in at an angle, kind of. So, but I feel like I'm getting a couple feet of grind when it works. Gosh, Jillian. Let's do it again. in the air, think pivot. Always forget these things. Lean back. Pike my hip. Get my weight centered. you want to go and throw your hips into it. Oh yeah, oh yeah, you got on top. Why is that Velcro coming undone? Are you wrapping it up wrong? Those are pretty new. Are the triple eight wrist guards not as good? Huh. Good effort. Remember you had your stall and your stall and your uh, your stand up grinds were going really good for a while and now you're doing the in the, the in the ramp stuff. See if you can get back up on top. There! There! Yes! That's what daddy means. Alright, let your old man take a break. Okay. I'm going up into the face. I'm going to stall it right here. As I do it, I wrap the legs, kick the knee back, walk the knee out, tweak the hip, shift the hips. Hi. Okay, let's do this. Oh, oh man, I did terrible. How are you? You want to sit in another chair? Um, well, my oh, okay. See you later. Bye. All right. Think about it less and do it by gut, instinct, and feeling. Okay, here. Let's see if that works better. Yeah, you know, I know what I need to do. For me, I honestly don't feel like pulling my front foot back helps me any. I feel a little more insecure on the board, so let me try doing away with that. Oh. I think I got a little piece of that one. You want me to do another one? You look pretty comfortable over there. Sometimes
Yeah, I'll do one more. Since your old man is climbed up here. Old man, I'm a young man. I'm a stag. And if I keep telling myself that, it's going to come to pass. I got it. I can't get it on that note, Billy. This will probably be my last run of the night, but I got to end it on a good note. Okay? Maybe turning my hat backwards means more business. It means more play, right? Like, get into it. You ready for this? They changed their minds. Oh, they did? Uh-huh. Oh! I gotta get one more, Philly. Then you can see Kelly in skate. Have you seen him skate before? No. He's good. He's way better than me on this thing. Yeah, you are. sure what's up with this trick. Sometimes I get it, it feels fantastic, I just don't know how I get into it. So. This was here, and my wheel, my wheel was locked, and my toe was on the board. Put this handhold here, and then I had the truck collapsed into wheel light. I could see how that could work. You guys see that? Wow. Let me try to do it reverse footing so you can see it on the camera here. See, your wheel's locked, your foot's on here. I'm trying to hold on to something because your wheel's locked. Your foot's, dude, see? Totally makes sense. I'm gonna pull my foot back so that my heel, my back foot heel is really hanging off the board. Then I'm gonna pull my front foot back and angle the toes forward a little bit more to try to be like in a better footing for hanging it up there. Let's see how we do. One more, dude. That time I put a lot of emphasis on the footing. This time I'm not going to put so much and put a little more emphasis into the effort of getting into the trick. I've been riding bone Swiss and bone uh, ceramics for a very long time. And then I got on a set of my old Bronson G2s. And I'll tell you what, they spin forever. They're really pretty darn good. So hit the like button if you're a Bronson G2 rider.